Welcome back, everyone. It's Stray Faye. You're with another episode of Harvest Moon, Tale of Two Towns. Load in. One more week of summer. Eat the cat. Eat the dog. How's the weather for today? It'll be a blazing hot day. It's great weather for growing crops or fishing. Tomorrow will be sunny all day because I believe it's a festival day tomorrow. And yeah, tomorrow is a crop festival. If we were in Bluebell, the 26th would be an animal festival. I believe it would be the dog festival. Um, I am not going to attend the crop festival just because I didn't prepare a radish. <laughs> and so there's no point. I figured it would really be that lucrative to attend any crop festivals until we unlock the seed maker anyway. And it looks like there's no more birthdays as well. So we can probably... Let's focus all our remaining time on fishing. We're just gonna fish, make money, um, maybe do some requests when it's not sunny. Yeah, I'll just do that until fall. Yeah, today's going to be another super chill episode. <laughs> chill but grindy, that's okay. We want to use the remaining time we have to just try to <laughs> trying to squeeze out squeeze out that last bit of profit out of summer. Then we can just try to coast through the rest of the year off our savings. Uh, what do I need to do? What do I need? I guess I can make some hot milk. <laughs> I guess I could, uh, make one for Ash as well. Rise the recipe. Now make another one. Cook with Ash recipe. Stuff like a random one just hanging out. Hanging out in storage. There we go. Do I have a random egg in here? It's like I'll have all these dangly, <laughs> these dangly bits. I feed this to a wild animal that we see that likes eggs. All right, I believe we got everything we need. Hi, Reyna. Oh, oh. Give random chats to people. Here you go. Oh, for me? Seriously? Awesome. Thank you. More, th more than anything, I feel like- I feel totally mellow when I'm here. Looks like he has, he has a wheelbarrow. He's probably picking up poop. Picking up all that horse doo-doo. Surprisingly easy to clean, horse doo-doo, though. It's mostly firm if it's like- It's not like cow pies. <laughs> If it's messy, then usually something's wrong with the horse, but it's just like nice little pellets. Well, not really pellet. It's kind, it's kind of a big ball, but somewhat easy to clean. You shall get... Uh, that's this one. Morning, Milan. You look like you're wide awake already. Oh, for me? Thanks. So, I'm like, hmm. There is some chili peppers that I can get. This is a little bit, a little expensive. Maybe a little pricey trying to get Kana spicy curry every day. I just need rice, and then I can just make five of those. Hopefully, I find rice before <laughs> these go bad. Red eyed tree frog enjoying a song. You're, you want to listen to a frog? I like flower. A song that is a song is a beautiful thing, but I want to make it into even more beautiful performance. I need that thing. Hmm? Don't you agree? You were going to listen to frog croaking. Banana. Uh, wow, it offers these like requests uh, 17 bamboo as a reward. Unfortunately, I can't grow banana trees. 
because screw you, game. They don't unlock until probably, I want to say year three. Some some trees unlock in year two, and then others unlock in year three. Aha, so you saw the message board. Thank you, I knew I can count on you, Milan. I think I can go in my storage. At least this one was easy to complete. Thanks, Milan, you did a great job, just like always. Music is so wonderful, it soothes the savage beasts. It's the height of culture. Don't you agree, Milan? Thanks a lot, you're a lifesaver. And now it's time for your reward. Put out your hands. Get a flower. I can make bread. Milan, thank you so much. You were a big help. You know, I used to think of you as a rival. But now I see how two parts could help each other out. I'm not even competing with you. <laughs> I don't even have crops. I'm just <laughs> messing around messing around on the mountain. Not even delving into your profits. I'm a regular one. I think I have some flowers I can give Nori. Kinda weird that I'm befriending her still. I don't really need to befriend her anymore, other than some random events that she stars in. It's not like I'm I can go on dates with her, but I do have enough friendship required to like get clothing items in the upcoming seasons. Hey Rahi. I'll give you a chat. Uh, I think that's it. Okay, I will make this flour into bread so I at least have something to give Rutger. His wife is just kind of kind of secondary. I, I just give like either rice or bread to his wife just because she's usually close by. It's like might as well do both. I figured out how to cook curry dumpling. Recipe recorded. Ah uh, yes, inspiration. I made bread, so I figured out how to make flavored bread. Oh novel. Alright, what the what the heck am I doing now? Let me just chat with Shang. Like I'm I'm not gonna really be seeing it anymore. <laughs> now that I'm like Using the bamboo for the panda instead. I, I wonder if bamboo is going to go out of season soon after summer. Might not have anything to give that panda anymore until I decide to grow crops. Probably won't even matter. I, I probably won't even be awake that late <laughs> in seasons that aren't summer. Ah, oh, piggy! This one. I haven't seen you in a while. Eat it. Yeah, you share, you share the same friendship table as uh, the brown one. Take, apricot. Wee. There's some other requests too. Red rose, small blue crab, tomato salad. I should probably head over to Bluebell first and poke around the shops <laughs> to see if I can easily complete those requests. Boink, boink. Oh, the rewards are rather nice. Or at least, rather voluminous. Salads. I think this is like the only year you can actually complete those requests by buying stuff from a store. Because as the years progress, uh, the townspeople ask for higher star ranked items. <laughs> and the stuff that you buy in stores is, is only half a star. Check this area. Brown mushroom. Kimeji. Jackie. Plum. All sorts of things in there. Flee, monkey! Actually, so many 
gathering spots here. It's one walnut. Hoping I can get a bamboo for later. Singing cicada, first time I caught this critter. Guess I'll keep it. Does, <laughs> does Georgia like it? Uh, I'm not sure. Sometimes I don't write it down, so. Just because there's so many, so many items and bugs. Princess cicada, bear cicada. She likes a lot of dragonflies, which will be important next season. I have something else I can give you. Cheaper quality. Let's give you the half star ranked one. Kind of sad, which you're here, which means your store isn't open. That for me, really? Wow, that's so nice, thanks. Would you like to go for a walk with me, Milan? Oh, uh, actually, sure, let's go. Where shall we go? Eey. What do you offer me? Outside of town, town square, or the flower bed? He's at purple, so I could do his purple heart event if I got the right one. Uh, his purple heart event? Ugh. It's triggered at the flower bed. However, it has to be a Tuesday between 6 p.m. and 10 p.m. Hmm. I'll go to the flower bed anyway. He likes that area. Let's -a go. It's so hot all the time. You make sure you don't get dehydrated. I know what else is hot there, Cam. It's <laughs> you. With this button down shirt. A lot of fun today. Hope we can talk again sometime soon. And he just leaves me here. <laughs> cart wherever it is. I'm Milan, how's it going? Why don't you come in and have something to eat? We got sweet things too. You have tomato salad. It has ice cream and choco banana again. Three more requests. Funa? Chamomile? And plum. I guess I'll just accept the Funa request. Pretty sure it's something I have to fish out of the river. I'm just not sure which location. Why, hello there, Milan. Uh, no, I don't think I finished a request. It's a secret. Oh, Milan, how are you today? No, I just want to give you bread. I will deal with you later. Maybe Camel sell roses tomorrow. Very unlikely, but... Really? Umbrellas? Can you sell, like, some flour or... Can the other one sell rice, for God's sake? No. Stop. I don't want to talk about requests right now. I just want to give you items. Butterfly. Hi Milan. My mom told you. <laughs> my mom told me to tell you to buy something. Thanks. I'm gonna show my brother. Welcome to our store. If you need something, go up to the counter. Kind of sucks for Cheryl having to run the store. Like, dude, she's like ten. <laughs> Can't run around and be a kid. She has to help have. Yes, to run the store counter for mom. Uh, let me go get my horse cart. I might have chamomile for for Eileen and some plums for Ash. Unfortunately, my horse cart got abandoned here. I have no chamomile. Wow. What are the odds? And no plums. I have one plum that I found today. Alright, let's go fishing. It was like a big waste of time. 
Well, not really a ways, because we still need to... ...befriend all these people, but it takes so much time to get over the mountain and talk to everyone. Just for Cheryl. Cheryl's gonna... Cheryl's gonna get to the flu... full-bloomed heart first. <laughs> He's gonna be my best friend. Little girl. More butterflies! Swallowtail! Alright, now we just fart around and fish till midnight. day now. I don't like the patience you need to do this for hours. I remember fishing as a kid. And like the best success we had ever was in like a stocked lake. And even then it took forever to catch anything. I was always super unlucky. I got like two fish. <laughs> but like somehow, like even though my brother was like in the same vicinity, he was like he had magic bait or something. <laughs> you caught like 38 of the fish. The bait did did uh help a lot. Like the best bait we could use. Um it was like this green paste and it had little glitteries in it. And it attracted so much fish. We tried other things like the the red fish eggs and like worms, and like other colored like fish paste bait. But like the green one with the sparklies in it was always the best. <laughs> and my brother was always super stingy about it. Actually, it was my dad that was super stingy about it because he didn't want to pay. <laughs> he didn't want to pay for it. it. I guess it was like the more expensive premium bait. My dad didn't even want to, like, go fishing with us, either. Because, since he was an adult, he would have had to pay for a license. <laughs> but since me and my brother were underaged, we we didn't have to pay for a license so we could fish for free. And it was, like, such an abandoned area, too. It was, like, not like anyone would have checked, but, like, my dad was so stingy he wouldn't even go fishing with us. He didn't want to pay for the license. Oh, man. It was fun fishing. I like, learn about holes and fishing lines and like all the bobbers you can attach to it and like the, the like lead weights that you can attach to like sink, sink down your hook. And all the hooks as well. Um, a lot of times different hooks would, <laughs> would uh, grant us different success rates. There was like a three pronged hook that would always catch fish. Well, like the one prong hook. I want to talk to you, Mark. Mark. Just wanted to chat with you, dude. Yeah, the three pronged hook would always catch fish, because <laughs> like no matter how the fish approached it, like it would always snag them. They couldn't just nibble off the side. <laughs> wow, the fish got smart with standard hooks. Now, if I wanted to go fishing, I would have to buy a fishing license. Ugh. And I probably would have to, like, repurchase all... all the stuff. I don't know what happened to our old fishing rods. We had them in the garage, but... either my parents still had them, have them, or... 
Maybe they ended up tossing him. They they might have gotten old. Not like we kept all the old bikes that we had as a kid. Like all our bikes got rusted after long storage in the shed. Yeah, that'd be a lot of stuff I'd have to purchase in order to go fishing again. And man, the long drive. We went to like it's in California, but it was called Virginia Lakes. Like that's where we went fishing. Like my dad had like a, a horn student whose parents um, had like a cabin in that area, and they would only use it as like a summertime cabin. They would only use it infrequently. So they're like, "Hey, yeah, if you like want to use it, just just like tell us like when, and yeah, you can borrow it. <laughs> like we'll give you the keys to the place." For like that week. Yeah, it was like a seven hour drive. I remember taking the dogs with us too. We'd always have to like tie him up outside. I was always get I would always get worried about Scooter not so much, but Biscuit I would always get worried about because he was a terrier. So he'd stick his head down every hole that he saw. I was so worried he was gonna get like bit by a snake or something. But Scooter was also a menace because he would bark and scare all the fish. Yeah, Scooter would always have a rough time though because of the altitude. I'd always have to spoon feed him. His nose would get all dry. I had to like spoon feed his food. But otherwise, I think he liked it because he got to spend so much time with like the family. Even though he got sick and it was very annoying. <laughs> I remember like when we went camping at like a different spot, my dog Scooter almost got us kicked out. We were, we were tent camping. And Scooter kept barking at all the leaves. It was like nothing, he would just bark at the leaves. And we almost got kicked out of the campground because we were disturbing the other campers. Like, I am sorry, my dog just... Is barking at the wind. We had to, we had to like keep him in a, in the tent. We couldn't look at anything. We only take him out when we were going on like a hike or something. Really late. Still not midnight yet. Right, bye, Mako. Stay out late, dude. Oh, oh, fish fossil. Score. Try to make it... A few more catches before I have to go to Bluebell. I trigger the event. For the eighth time. <laughs> Feel bad, man. <laughs> so, so many times I have to trigger the same event over and over again. For the same dialogue. Headphones, are you dying? Oh, I just put away my rod. I think my headphones are dying. Okay. <laughs> it's like I, I can't hear the background noise. Like the, the owl and the, the bugs chirping. Or the fish getting caught at the end. I kind of, I kind of want to hear those indicators, please. Come on, one more fish, and then I'll go to Bluebell. It's kind of a long, a long trek. Yeah. All right. Good haul. I don't think I caught any Funa. At least not in this area. 
Ew. I can't believe I don't have two chamomile to give you. Put it on. Pop away. Is there any areas that I haven't... I don't think I... forged this area down here. I like the little mouse. Flee! Flee from your overlord! Pearl mushroom. Weed. Weed. <laughs> Magic blue flower. Yeah, I think that's one of the few areas that I didn't forage at yet. Well, maybe tomorrow. Late butterfly to your doom. I am the greatest predator on this mountain. It's almost midnight, let's hurry. As I get distracted with all these bugs. I shouldn't <laughs> I shouldn't feel too bad. It's it's a pretty good way to stock up gifts for Dirk. I don't have to purchase tea for him because tea does spoil. Even though it's a pretty common item and cheap to buy at Yoon's, it does spoil after a while. Alright, this is number eight. <laughs> and then plus, plus two from Raul's side. But yeah, ten total. Good work today. How are things with you, Enrique? <laughs> Just fine. up. What are you doing there, Milan? Try to listen in on people's conversations. More importantly, how did you get in? <laughs> At this point, I should be like, guys, you should, you should have learned your lesson by now. The door wasn't locked. Oh no, I forgot to lock it again. See, this is all your fault, guys. What were you thinking? You can't keep forgetting. You can't keep forgetting to lock the door. How long are you going to stand there? It's late, you should go home. Yeah, it is a long a long drive over that mountain. Where are you going? You have to go out the front door, not the back door. Teehee. <laughs> Teehee. Oopsie poopsie. <laughs> Alright, where's my horse? Perhaps later. Last minute request giving. My contribution, Bluebell, from the town fisherman. I am just the fish. I am the fishmonger slash fish fossil enthusiast. All right, what else do I? I guess tomorrow is just gonna be fishing all day because it's the crop festival and I'm not gonna attend to it. But I don't need to stay up until midnight. Because it is Saturday and I don't think I can trigger the general store event on a Saturday. Every day, it's like every day except Saturday. And some festival days it seems like. Just ignore the panda, I don't have anything to give the panda so I guess I can pet it but... That's the point of no return! Heart kit. Of course, gonna make it back on its own. And let's go to bed without saving. Get through another day. It took us 30 minutes to get through today. Ah, uh, what's wrong with us? Today's a summer crop festival. We'll go to the town hall around noon. The theme is radish. <laughs> the dog is like still asleep and trying to eat. The 
be blazing hot all day, and then tomorrow will be sunny all day. Oh boy, more fishing. I'm obligated to fish on sunny days. Really? <laughs> we can bounce off the rim. still gift the blue bellions, but I don't have anything to give Rutger. Except maybe some... I guess I can give him a flower. Uh, let's put some milk. Do I have any spoiled food that's going bad? Uh, I forgot what recipe this is uh, for mushrooms. I don't really need to yet, but there is a recipe for steamed... Mushrooms? I forgot if it's a pot or no ingredient. Let's see, cooking, 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 activities. Let me just go to item list. Don't tell me without me having to go to different categories. It's called steamed mushrooms. Oh, it's a frying pan of all things. I guess we're like kind of sauteing it. Oh, you made steamed mushrooms. It's your first time making this recipe recorded. I can actually use this as an excuse to, like, cook stuff. And perhaps gain inspiration for other dishes. This is actually a good gift if you have a lot of mushrooms. This is a good gift for Oracle when you meet her later, if you don't have any alpaca wool to give her. Everything else is still fresh, so... I'll just cook it when it starts going bad. Steamed mushrooms are like an easy gift if you happen to forage a lot. Uh, there are no people here I can talk to right now, but... I, I did not even boil the milk. I'm an idiot. <laughs> Two failed dishes. Alright, I can do that. Oops, let's put that away. And uh, let's go back home and boil up that milk, don't you know? And make some failed dishes for Mako next I see him. Five days is pretty much is like the last request I can do before the season's over. Inspiration for some other milk recipe. Uh, fresh. Aluminum foil. I don't have aluminum foil. Second. <laughs> Just uh, whatever. Just make whatever failed dish. Recipe. What's what's going bad in here? That's going bad. Okay. Next, I see Mako. I just remember to talk to him. I have five days to remember, so or five days to forget. However, you want to look at it. Mm -mm. I think I'll head over. Bluebill and then come back and do fishing. Uh, would be nice to get a plum though. I can 
complete Ash's request. Tada! Ouch. <laughs> no, Tada! I'm gonna give you this. Go. Chuck. Aha, okay. Found a plum. Give that to Rucker. No, I don't have anything else to give him. No bread, no rice. He likes flowers. Opal cicada. <laughs> Does Georgia like opal cicadas? I didn't write it down, but... You can go home. You can leave. I'll spare your life. She might like it, I just might not have written it down, because I... I pretty much made a guide for myself, but I made it very abridged. Because I, I didn't want to get overwhelmed with too much information. I could write a paragraph for each character about what they like. No, I didn't want you! I just wanted- I wanted a very abridged, easy gift guide. And I, I- just like having to read through paragraphs and paragraphs of stuff would have been too much for my little mind. Hey, chamomile! I actually need another one for... I mean, and here it is. Hey. <laughs> uh, dum da da da! He uses slides, zip lines, and bouncy mushrooms 300 times. Congratulations. Remember, once you go down a slide, you can't go back up it. Anyway, have fun. Keep on using them. Toodles. Unless you're playing Mario and can just, like, back... <laughs> backpedal up them. <laughs> is it backpedal or is it, like, uh... I thought it was backpedal or... Like, uh, belly flopping. Help them. <laughs> Did I... Do I have the chamomile in here, or did I not put it away? I just didn't put it away. Oh well, it's still good. It's still good, I think. I wonder if I just gave you a cicada. Like, I don't know if you like it, but... Thank you kindly. Even if it's just a neutral reaction, I'll, I'll take it. because I want it out of my bag. Thanks, I'm gonna show my brother! Teehee! Ash's mom has got it going on. Not even wooing Ash, wooing his mom. How you doing? Good morning, Milan. How are you today? There you are. I've been waiting. Thanks so much. You know how Cheryl gets gets when she wants something. I have to make it for her. Spoiling your sister. No wonder she's a brat. Two plums, although giving her two pieces of fruit is probably not that crazy, but thanks. Good work. This is perfect. Now I can make that dessert Cheryl wanted. Oh, you're making her a whole dessert, not just a piece of fruit. Huh? You think I spoil her? Mm, maybe you're right. My mom's always chiding me not to spoil her so much. You know, when she looks at me with those huge eyes and says, I don't want a I don't want others. I want the ones you make. There's no way I can refuse her. Guess I'm kind of a sucker that way. Well, what can I do? Make my sister happy and making my animals happy is what I live for. Why your <laughs> sister's got a brother complex. Thanks so much for all your help your help. Let me give you your reward. I hope you like it. At least you get along with your sister. Don't like fight with her or anything. Like sibling relationships, a lot of times aren't healthy. Either you like get overspoiled or pumpkin. What the heck? I do not have pumpkin. Either one gets super spoiled or they just like fight all the time. <laughs> with my brother, it was fighting all the time. Um, give you, 
I'll give you one of the higher quality ones. This one. The requested item. Thank you so much! This looks great! I have a wreath on hanging on my door, but it's all wilted, so I have to make a new one! Hee hee hee! I'm pretty handy, you know. I'm gonna make a really cute wreath. You are a construction person. An architect. And everything. You've been a big help, thanks! Well, here's your reward! Honeycomb... Oops, do not toss. Honeycomb's not that crazy of quality, so I'll just sell it. And, uh, let's check Cam's... Yes! <laughs> Welcome to Cam's Flowers! Perfect! This is the first time I'm buying something for him, it's to complete a request. I'll buy the roses. Thank you, take good care of it. Yes, I think this is the first time I've actually, like, looked in Cam's store. <laughs> you can also make bouquets, which you can either- you can give them as gifts, or... Uh... Yeah, you can put them in the little vase slash basket that's in your house to kind of like decorate the place and eventually you have to replace them, but... You also make perfume, which you can either sell for money or give as gifts as well. Got an extra chamomile for you. Good morning, Milan! How's it going? That's one of my favorite things! Thanks! This makes me really happy. I think I have a... I have some mint just hanging out in here that I can give Cam. Where are your hours? Okay. Hey, look, there's a chocolate ice cream. Your menu, fruit parfait, chocolate ice cream. That actually isn't that expensive. <laughs> I just felt like buying one for Enrique. Good morning, Milan! Good morning to you, Howard. Good morning, Milan. You seem to be doing well. Ah, you checked the message board. Thank you. Now remember, don't tell anyone about this request. This is our secret, Milan. Right, two red roses. In exchange for that... Good work, Milan. Thank you for delivering this. Let me- I'll tell you. You see when I- <laughs> what I asked you for? It's a present from my beloved Rose. Oh, a rose for his rose. Oh dear, I gone- I gone said it. Now, how embarrassing. You know, you could've just bought this from Cam's store, but okay. Now remember, this is a secret. No letting word of it slip to Rose. Thank you. Now, you've been a real help. Well then, here's your reward. 19 plums. Thank you for all your help, Milan. I knew I can count on you. See you next time. Take care. It's so weird to see these random requests that just give you obscene amounts of, like, X item. Granted, they're forageables, but the game's been <laughs> pretty stingy otherwise. Brothers, I brought chocolate ice cream for one of you. Chocolate ice cream, chocolate ice cream, chocolate ice cream! I'm so excited, thank you so much! Wow, he really, really likes chocolate ice cream. What do you want, Funa? I'm not gonna get you that, unfortunately. I have some random chicken feet in here, here you go. Make him happy! I think I, I think I did everything I needed to do. I, I guess I could keep trying to find tomato salad. Yeah, just Mako. Next time I see Mako, I can give him some uh, kale dishes. <laughs> uh, sorry, I keep like jumping off my horse to double check my inventory. All right, empty, but empty fish bag. Spend the rest of the evening fishing. Oh, I 
was hoping maybe I can find a bamboo to give the panda. Like maybe maybe I just like hang around till nine. <laughs> so I can like bother the panda, but no dice. It's just Terry on. Get, get my offerings for Cheryl. Swallowtail. Uh, have I checked this area up here yet? <clears throat> Yeah, cough, cough. There's nothing useful there. Wrong tool. Time to fish. Spent so much time just... It's amazing, like, how much time you can sink just, like, going into the other town. Just talking. Just socializing. It's a big old time sink. Lifetime. Oh boy, this is. Uh, I'm already at like 46 minutes. Thought I was gonna do another three days, but maybe not. I mean, I could squeeze it. I could just force myself. How late I should fish. <laughs> How late do I want to go? I don't have to go all the way to midnight, but there's no reason why I don't like have to stop. Like the character never seems to get tired. You know what? How about we go until like six-ish? I think by then um, the other townspeople will have uh, exited the festival. <laughs> And then I can just turn into the failed dish and like do one more day. I would like to perhaps start next episode on the 27th, do three days, and then the next episode after that get into fall. on the AC after recording this this session as well. I reached the limit on Oh, what the heck? Holy lag. Oh god. Why is it lagging now? What does 430 signify? Are people out of the festival? Is that, is that what the game's trying to tell me? Please don't crash. You're not allowed to crash on this mountain. <laughs> this is not a physical cartridge of Tale of Two Towns for the 3DS. I know, it really sucked that like the physical cartridge of the 3DS version was kind of glitchy. Oh wait, duck. But the one for DS was fine. But they patched it. They patched the, the eShop copy of Tale of Two Towns 3DS. 
but they didn't release a patch for the people who had physical cartridges, which I thought was weird. <laughs> like, can you just- that was- like, you could have done it. <laughs> it was on the 3DS, it's like the era where patching could happen. And it happens all the time now, luckily. Something breaks. They don't have to do a reprinting of the game, they can just release a patch. I'm gonna go back to town. We can do one more day. I saw the weasel, I'm just like, do I have an egg? I do calculations in my head. Uh, everyone's probably inside. Well, so you didn't take part. I'm sorry. I just, I just didn't have a crop. <laughs> so I just figured it was a waste of time. Thank you, this is what I need. I'm gonna use this to make fertilizer that's never been seen before. Then I'm going to present it to the Academic Society. And when I do, you're coming with me, Milan. No, I'm not. I can't even leave this town. There's no exits in this town. What are you talking about? Watch a tea. I can give that to... Hero. <laughs> yeah, it's not even like the town has an exit. Like, A Wonderful Life had the path up the mountain, or like, Magical Melody had that gated path that you couldn't get past. There's literally no path out of here. It's like, you're in the Lost Woods. Where did you go today? The Summer Crop Festival was very enjoyable. Everyone's gonna be like, how dare you didn't participate. I didn't join in today. Were, weren't you feeling well? Should I take a look at you? Hang on, I'm like doing all these other festivals. I don't have to take part in every festival, dude. <laughs> I'm just being so rude. Oh, I don't think I gave that flower to Rucker. Well, maybe tomorrow. Did I literally find no... Found zero fish fossils today. How very lame. Gotta preserve that flower for one more day. Got 19 plums. If anyone wants plums, you better ask me. Sleepy time. Let's do one more day. Squeeze it out. Go to bed without saving. Check. Oh, missed it. It's weather, like blazing hot. Or I'll be sunny. Alright. Another projected days of fishing. Just wanna let the dog finish eating so I can check it. I go say hi, Jessica. Do, 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 do. 
do. wants what? She got three more requests. Shiitake? Might have it. Tomato salad. <laughs> Another thing that I have to bother Howard for and two materials to- I can do that. Chattering cicada. Do I have any other- I can actually do the eastern locust. Ah, Milan, you know what I like? Hee hee hee. Like Nori. These. I have another to give Rutger if he wants it. If I remember. Fortunately for me, I don't think I can even buy rice today. Roll store is closed. Uh, I guess I'll just go this way. I can still give Kana a horse street. I forgot. Um, God, I'm just like going all over the place. Uh, do I have a shiitake? I do have two shiitake that I can give. Uh, a hewn. Uh, I'll give her this one. Unfortunately, I don't have any other, other better quality ones, so I'll give her this half star one. It'll average out. Very good morning to you. Are you feeling hungry? Oh, you saw the message board. I did indeed. Here you go. Oh my, such lovely ingredients. They look wonderful. Thank you. I knew I could count on you. You've been such a help. Let's see now. I've got to give you your reward. Here you are, dear. I got an eel. Potentially cook with it, but I don't know what to make with it. <laughs> Good morning. I'm sleepy. I'll just get crappy quality ones for Shay. It's all over the place today. But it's fine. I do need to complete these requests. I need to raise my request level for various things in the future, so... It's fine if I do it now versus later. It's just the giant grind elephant beetle. No, I didn't mean to check it. Sunday, I could possibly be able to go on a date with Dirk if I checked in later. I don't even know if he likes me enough, though. Uh, I don't want to give you anything, I just want to turn in your request. Ah, oh, Milan, so you're here, just as I, ex as I expected. Yep. Two of those. Oh! This is it, this is what I need! I'm embarrassed to say that I ran out of materials for fixing up my tools! Didn't know what I was gonna do. This is a real help, thanks! Now for your reward. I got you something. I knew you'd like it. Here you go! Apple jam. Forgot you don't give me bamboo. It's Ying that gives me bamboo. Right, two requests done. Now I just need a lot of tomato salads. <laughs> Which I'll try to get today. Let's see. Let's uh... Traverse reverse over that mountain. I'm okay, mildly curious. Oh, God, so many. Sir, what time do you want to go on a date? You can ask him between 11 and 4 on Sundays. It's Thursday and Saturday, you can ask him after 6. Random 
like grab it. I wasn't even looking where I was going. I just like looking at my other screen. A screen that has my notes on it. And I'll keep it. Meal. I can give that to Lainey. I don't think I have any mint for Cam. Just trying to find a mint out of desperation that I could potentially give Cam. And another chamomile. Well, guess we're just gonna mac on Laney today. It's a festival today. All right, it's uh, it's the dog festival today. Summer animal festival. Or if you're in year two, it'd be the cat festival, and it just kind of alternates from there. Hey, actually, I have a blue one. I can give you. I'll give you that one. I just love this and you got it for me. Ah, thank you kindly. I have a lot of... Pretty big stacks of butterflies now, actually. I should probably be giving this hot milk to Ash. Instead of, uh, Jessica. You could join us if you lived in our village. Well, I don't. Curry powder, but... Yeah. No flour or anything. A red bouquet. 20 plums. <laughs> Uh, I could do that. I just need to get three red flowers from Cam's store. Uh, let's see. Let me see if I can do this. Three, nine. I need three red roses. I think it's any three red flowers. That makes a red bouquet. I think I could even have used the magic red flowers, but let's just make it simple. Here it is. Red bouquet. <laughs> Thank you. Take good care of it. Pretty. Super fresh bouquet with various red flowers. I could even uh, put it in my house if I wanted to, but... Hang on. I always forget to do this. Get the moon drop. Or did I already get it out? Did I already get it out? I did. I'm an idiot. Hello there, Milan. Today is our summer animal festival. I'm really sorry, but you can't participate in it. Now then, you must have seen the message board. Easy. <laughs> I can just make it at the store. I cabs flowers. Ah, how beautiful. Rose will look absolutely radiant with this. Good work, Milan. I knew I could count on you. Once again, you could have just gone to Cam's flowers and made this yourself, but okay. Thank you. Uh, you've been a real help. Well then, here's your reward. 20 more plums. Thank you for all your help, Malone. I know I can count on you. See you next time. Can I give this to you, or are you just gonna be like, I'm sorry, you can't attend the animal festival. Alright, you're gonna be- you're gonna do that instead. <laughs> you're gonna act like that. I'm so excited about today's festival. I don't have anything for you, lady. Unless you want a plum. I don't have anything for you. Do you have salads? You have cheesecake and chocolate banana. Not salads, unfortunately. Well, guess I can't do anything about that. What the heck am I gonna do with all these plums? <laughs> like, I don't know what to make with them. It's too many. 
the heck? Lainey, get away from my horse! Oh, we're gonna go do some fishing before... going to bread. Hey, Eileen. Is there any animals I can pester, potentially? Give me that butterfly. I'm a butterfly. Hey, there's a mint. I could have given that the cam, I just didn't see it. It blended in at the ground. down here? Any egg-eating creatures? A tanuki and a fox. only have one egg. I forgot to get the other one out of my wagon. Please eat that! Oh my god, I gotta like put it at your paws. Don't run away from it! <laughs> you go. Ah, oh, you are too close to that river. No, thank you. The tanuki's gonna get it. Could have had a free meal, but you blew it. You're getting super scared of me. I mean, fair. Fair enough. You're a wild animal. Once again, I spent a crap ton of time just messing around in the other- in, in Bluebell. What lament is that? In this, this freaking hole. <laughs> Alright, let's see if I can catch a fish fossil or two. Let's see if I can break past 300,000 gold! So the next episode is gonna be a lot of the same. <laughs> Mainly fishing, but of course I'm gonna get distracted with friendships and requests, but yeah. It's like the last few days we can actually fish for fish fossils, we gotta utilize it. 300,000 gold is pretty good. Let me see my, calcu my, my calculations projected calculations for the future. It can always change, because I, I can always waste my money. So, yeah, so the field... The next field I'm gonna get is only gonna cost me 20,000 gold. I think I'm gonna get a watering can upgrade for 5,000. And some clothes, which I forgot how much it is. I, oh, 30,000 for new clothes. That will... yeah, I'll have plenty. <laughs> I'll have plenty for that. <clears throat> and the next upgrades after that. For winter and spring. As long as I'm not stupid with spending money, I'll have enough. Stay hydrated. Of course, they spilled a bunch on me. <clears throat> oh, finally! Don't lose it! <laughs> I think I haven't caught one in a while.
Fish bones, lame. Six. I kind of just want to head back home. Turn in a little early. I can still have a lot of stamina though in bag space. Eh, I just right know I'm gonna fill up the bag. The large one's trying to bite it. No, oh, that's the medium fish. Don't be a tease. Another one. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna be greedy and do another one. This will be the last one. I'll go to bed. Go to bed around nine ish. Maybe I'll just visit, I'll visit the panda and just slap it. Eh, not quite nine. It comes out at nine p.m. So I gotta like make sure I enter the screen after nine p.m. One more. Okay, that's good. Good. Good and tog. Did I collect? I think I probably collected the bamboo already. Oh, there's one right here! Never mind, I didn't. That's lucky. Um, don't be scared. Eat. Eat. <laughs> yeah, I have to like stop fleeing and just eat it. The long process of befriending the panda begins with a single step. It's over here. Another plum. This is exactly what I'm missing in my life is more plums. So I'm safe. <laughs> gonna put everything away. I'm already at six pages. I gotta stop collecting stuff. Crab is going bad. I should clean that up. Clean it out of my my bag. Get rid of you. Get rid of you. Get rid of you. 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 Is there anything in here that's turning fairly fresh? Oil. I could probably cook with oil, but <laughs> once again, it's one of those things that I like. I don't know what to cook, so. 
I can... I know I can convert the mushrooms into steamed mushrooms. Okay, it's just the crab. I'm just like, I can't really cook with it yet, because... I'm missing a lot of other ingredients. So, let's get rid of it, because it's just gonna spoil. I have like a dead, rotting crab corpse at the bottom of this cart. Alright, I think we're good. Stored away everything we needed to store. Uh, let's see, next episode we'll hopefully get through three more days, and then unfortunately there's still two more days after that. Before we hit fall. This, these seasons are long, 31 days. Alright, we will save off screen as per usual. I hope you guys had a relaxing time, and I'll see you in the next episode. Oh, bye bye.